Hello, today we're going to be doing a varnished wood material in Unreal Engine. So I will be showing you how to do a clear coat. So basically the clear coat will be the varnish. So it this will be it's it will be fairly simple, but it's kind of advanced for materials. So we will be doing a very simple node setup and we'll try to recreate this material that we have here. So pretty much the clear coat is kind of like a layer that lays on top of the actual material itself which I'm not sure if you can see it and you can in the video and I and you can also like change its roughness um, like I can make it brighter I can make it obviously very dull uh, and it would be like if we didn't have a clear coat and you can give it a uh, normals wh whatever you want so I want to close this up and um, so just open up an, an empty project and we want a wood alvedo texture so just your regular color texture a normal map and a roughness map you don't need the displacement although you can add it if you want it's not necessary and you can download this in a in like texture heaven or a site also called cg texture which I think they changed, oh, they changed the name, their name to textures. This is also a very good site. So I want to create a material and I want to call it M wood tutorial. I want to open it up. And I want to drag these textures if I, I guess I can't, okay. So, look up texture sample and we want this to be our our alvedo so I want you to put that in our base color I want to select the normal uh, texture sample oh no texture no, texture coordinate well actually we could have added that too but not necessary for this tutorial so you want to plug this into the normal and finally the roughness which actually it isn't necessary but I want you to add it anyways and we want this in our roughness so if we apply we should be able to see a very basic wood material and it might not look bad as you can see it already looks like it's varnished but we're going to make it better by adding a clear coat it will be more photorealistic so the first thing we want to do is um, pretty much get rid of some of this roughness that we have here so I'm going to, I'm sorry, add more roughness. And so for that, we are going to get a clamp node. So we could do a multiply. So multiply. And let's multiply this by, I don't know, maybe four. Let's see how this looks. So as you can see, it now looks more duller, I guess you could say. And to add the clear coat, we want to select the output node and we want to change the shading model. So we want to change this to clear coat. And two options will appear, clear coat and clear coat roughness. So basically these will, uh, we need pretty much two uh, um, Scale, scalar values so you can press S to create a parameter and let's call this roughness for our clear coat and let's leave it at zero sorry about that that's my doc um, and let's create another one for the clear coat power I guess you could say oh I uh, typo 
and we want this set to 1. Um, let's plug this in. Default value 1. And you can change this. You can make it higher, although it won't really make a difference. I think it goes up to 1. So if we apply this, we should be able to see our results. And as you can see, this looks much nicer than just having and just making your regular roughness uh, lower. So I hope you enjoyed this video and you got something out of it. If you did, please make sure to like and subscribe. See you in the next, in the next one. Bye.